The latest entry in Kratos' story was phenomenal, but maybe these titles will hold you over until the sequels? Cause you know, there's gonna be sequels, right? Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 games to play if you liked God of War 2018. You have disrespected the gods for the last time, Kratos. <laughs> for more gaming videos, check out our new spin-off channel, Mojo Plays, for in-depth reviews, thoughtful video essays, detailed character origins, and insightful commentary. Mojo Plays, games smarter. For this list, we're recommending a few games you might want to check out if you enjoyed God of War. They might not exactly be like the game, but there's something for everyone on this list. Number 10, God of War 3 Remastered. I see only what I have come to destroy. Of all the games you could play from the franchise, God of War 3 Remastered is probably the definitive experience for the older titles. This was the most crucial point in Kratos' story, after all showing how he brought an end to the Greek pantheon as well as displaying a younger, aggressive, and insanely violent Ghost of Sparta. <laughs> Running at 60 frames per second at 1080p, this remaster adds more depth to Kratos' story too, while showing series newcomers what the older titles were like. The gore is insanely over the top, and the variety of new toys at Kratos' disposal kept gameplay fresh, frantic, and fun. You can easily jump into this game without really worrying about missing too many details anyway. Number 9, American McGee's Alice. Wonderland's become quite strange. How is one to find her way? As knowing where you're going is preferable to being lost, ask. If you're looking for another third person action adventure game, but with more elements of horror and dark fantasy, American McGee's Alice should suffice. A traumatized Alice must journey into a corrupt and twisted version of Wonderland, which may or may not be an imaginary world in her mind. You'll never encounter a dull moment, as Alice balances an equal amount of story, exploration, combat, and puzzle solving. The nightmarish world should keep you engaged and wanting to explore more of its dark and horrific environments. It's a uh, very imaginative version of Alice in Wonderland, and it's perfect for those of you who enjoy the overall experience God of War delivered. Number 8, Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. It's been stuck in there for 15 years and it's because of me. And the guy who broke him out wants a lot of money and the only way we can pay off the debt is Avery's treasure. Do you enjoy the cinematic experience of God of War? Well, then the Uncharted games might be up your alley, more specifically Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. While it's still a linear adventure, the final chapter in Nathan Drake's story uses elements of open world gameplay too. On top of that, Uncharted 4 is simply an astounding third person adventure game with a compelling story. I mean, we didn't name it one of the best games of 2016 for nothing. There's even a good assortment of collectibles to nab, which may or may not be more difficult than God of War's collectibles. If you haven't played an Uncharted game though, you might want to start out with the Nathan Drake collection first. Quite a day. Yeah, yeah, save the world, triumph over evil. <laughs> Pretty typical. <laughs> really? Number seven, For Honor. <laughs> Are you looking to kick even more ass with an axe? Are you still longing to become a bloodthirsty viking? For Honor will probably satisfy that dream. It may not have impressed a huge amount of players when the game launched in February of 2017, but Ubisoft is still supporting the game with community events and new content. However, the main attraction in For Honor is the deep combat mechanics. You aren't just flailing weapons around and hoping to kill your opponent first. You actually have to focus on when and where you're trying to strike. It may not involve building combos as heavily as God of War, but the combat is just as challenging, plus the people are real. You captured zone A. Number 6, Dark Souls series. Speaking of challenge, Dark Souls is one of the most notoriously difficult franchises in gaming. So if Give Me God of War mode somehow wasn't difficult enough for you, this should satisfy that itch. While the combat is significantly slower than God of War, it's also more deliberate and strategic, meaning that it will test every ounce of skill. You will probably become frustrated, you will probably lose a large amount of souls, and you will die a lot. Number 5, Darksiders series. I serve only the council. Only the balance. When the first Darksiders game was released, critics compared much of the gameplay to God of War. Well, the older ones, not the newer one. However, even with the new one, those comparisons still basically ring true. Darksiders and its sequel deliver exciting experiences to the action-adventure genre. 
Both incorporate RPG mechanics while letting players experiment with building combos and exploring environments in a semi-open world structure. With THQ Nordic working on a third entry in this series, now's a good time to jump in. Number 4. Nier Automata What path will you take? It's up to you to decide. Now, I know what you're thinking. How in Helheim is Nier Automata anything like God of War? We'll admit it kind of seems like an odd choice at first, but Nier Automata isn't just being recommended for its combat and narrative. I mean, think about it. In this action RPG, you get to engage in epic boss fights with massive beasts, so if you're itching for more hacking and slashing, you'll quickly see why Nier was hailed as one of 2017's best games. It also boasts multiple endings that'll keep you playing and replaying until you've seen everything the game has to offer. They began attacking their friends! I managed to help the children flee to safety. Number three, The Last of Us. So I'll take one guess. The uh, whole deal went south and the client made off with our pills. Is that about right? <laughs> deal went off without a hitch. It's the game God of War is consistently compared to, and it's the game that basically no one stopped talking about five years later. Naughty Dog's brilliant post-apocalyptic masterpiece, The Last of Us, is best known for telling one of the best and most touching stories in gaming. Whether you're playing the original PS3 version or the PS4 remaster, you'll find this to be one of the most beautiful games of the decade. Naughty Dog is currently working on part two, which is expected to launch sometime within the next year, so better late than never. You know, I've never been this close to the outside. Number two, Bayonetta series. I could never call the man behind this nightmare father. All right, so maybe you're someone who isn't looking for a game with an emotional story or a complex narrative. Maybe you want something that's similar to the visual flair and simple fun that lies in God of War's combat. Well, either of the Bayonetta games should leave you satisfied then. While the admittedly silly and provocative content might turn some players off, Bayonetta and its sequel are highly praised for their insane, fast-paced, and stylish action. Whether you're a hardcore gamer looking for a challenging experience or a casual gamer wanting a power fantasy, Bayonetta is thrilling in every way imaginable. And hey, if you got a Switch, both Bayonetta games are available right now, with Bayonetta 3 coming soon as a Switch exclusive. Number 1. Hellblade – Senwa's Sacrifice there's no doubt about it. The source of the darkness is in Helheim. Many of the games on this list incorporate specific pieces of what made God of War so amazing to play. As for Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice, it ticks just about every single checkbox, even down to the Norse mythology setting. A young warrior must journey through Helheim in order to save the soul of her lover. With incredibly detailed environments, an engaging combat system, and a very compelling narrative, Hellblade was one of the biggest surprises to come out of 2017. The game may only last about half the amount of time as God of War, but it is, without a doubt, well worth that time. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.